Touching the lakeside region, Kisumu Museum is a must see place. It is located in Kisumu town along Kisumu Kericho Highway. It was opened in 1980 and it stores information on cultural and scientific issues. Kisumu Museum exhibits cultural history. It has a collection of local flora and fauna and a traditional Luo homestead. Let's have a look at how a homestead of a married man looks like. Houses within a traditional Luo homestead are specially located based on their inhabitants. The hierarchy of the wives is considered. The first house belongs to the first wife called Mikai in Luo dialect. And this first structure must face the main gate. The husband must stay here two to three months in order to fulfill rights and obligations. The second house belongs to the second wife called Nyachira. The husband will vacate from the first wife's house to the second wife's house in order again to fulfill the rights and obligation. There is also the third house at the middle of the homestead which is like an office. Another house is called Simba and this house belongs to the son that is still living within the father's homestead. Lastly, there is Dero that is used to store foodstuffs, especially cereals. Kisumu Museum also has a snake garden and the snake house has a collection of pythons, vipers and the black mamba. There is also a collection of tortoises and crocodiles at the crocodile pen without forgetting the aquarium which shows different types of fresh water fish. At the museum building, artifacts are displayed including tools that were used in the past by different ethnic groups. Kisumu Museum is also a point for seminars and workshops, both international and local. It's also a research point. It also provides educational services. We really had a good time here in Kisumu Museum. We really enjoyed, we've been entertained, we've learned a lot. 